That's all I played a minute ago. It's from a Nils Lofgren song called Empty Heart. It runs on the guitar riff that goes... Very convenient to play here. But you'd be an octave too high, so you really have to go. So up to C, B flat C, G F, then this E flat, then to the B flat, then D C. And on a strat, if you put it in the bridge position, I think it gets a lot bit closer. Right, reverse the start. I'm playing that in a one-fingered uh, two-note chord. I'm playing that for C minor. All I'm playing is a C and a G, just like a five chord. There's a E flat, right? My thinking there is, is if you went... It, it's just too many notes. I think the keyboards will be playing that anyway. And we know it's in a minor key because... So I think it sounds better too. Yeah. And then I can't stand living with an empty heart. The bridge section is fantastic. One, two, three, four, F. One, two, three, four, A flat. And you know something's about to happen. F and those plays up, right? Um, the first line is the first first four notes of a C five note scale. Now you've probably heard a, a million guys play those four notes, but you know, when he plays it, it's it's on fire. I know this is personally one of Nils Lofton's favourite guitar solos that he's done, and that is really saying something. Because he's, I don't know, 30 or 40 absolute top flight world class solos in his career. Probably more, probably double that. But he comes in with this. And snap the C. Now the next line, I'm going to angle the guitar. Um, I hope this isn't, isn't patronising, but so you can see it better. Next line is... Right? Now, you see I'm making a jump with my third finger there. So what if you went... Because there's a lot of vibrato. Because it's very, it's very wild. Yeah, that's really what those are the notes we're looking for. So we bend the four notes down. First finger knee fat, second finger, reach round with the third. Next line is what most of us probably call the Hendrix lick. You know, where you um, bend the string and you catch the string on the next one down. So the notes that Nulls plays are after, after this is right after. Playing by catching it. Like that, right? But you can see where the notes are bend the B flat to a C. Like that one then. And there's two places in the solo where you play one note uh, in two positions. 
There's an F. There's an F. So we do that. Right? Back to the neck. I can play that, right? I love that bit. I love it all actually, but it's off a five note C scale. Right, and I pushed it there. It's if you're in the you know if you're in the vibe, it's good to pull it. See what's happening now? Ends with two F notes, but the second one is E flat pulled up. Through. Next line. Right, very, very nose line that, and it's using a ninth, the D. Five minutes skill. Right, so you see this comes off the G, we play a B flat. There's a D. And then we'll go down from the C. To the G, right? We then play this. It's a lovely line off the F note, right? F G, and we're looking down in that E flat little trill. Then, so that's like a G minor arpeggio, and we end on the Jimi Hendrix snap leg. And we end on that uh, B flat note. So the last bit is. So we do the arpeggio, but with the bend. Then. As I say, if you want to catch it. And that's it. That is Nose's solo um, from Empty Heart.